everybody and welcome back to my time at Porsche. Uh, she lab on her sofa. I don't know what about she lab on her sofa, but she lab on her sofa. That's all you need to know. Right. Um. I wanted to make a DD stop, not a DD transport. A DD stop. I can make a DD transport if I want to sell it for lots of money. Okay, so. I need four bronze plates, which I probably have, two bronze pipes, which I do not have, five hardwood planks, which I do not have, and three fiber cloth, which I do have. Okay, so I need to put some more fiber cloth on at this skyver. The fuel is depleted. No! I never check the fuel on the ones with the um, power stones. I'm terrible for that. I check on the ones for wood because they run out all the time, but I just expect these to last forever. Okay, so. Did I put the worn fur and the fibre away? Probably. So, worn fur. Fibre. And we'll just up that to ten. So I'm going to take three of them to make this. Uh, I actually need hardwood as well much as I can to make some hardwood planks. I need five of them. And then I need bronze plates as well. I'll craft ten of them just for convenience sake because I'm going to need another one for over the other way anyway. So four bronze plates got made overnight. I'm going to just pick up all of these. I'm going to need to redo their fuel. Oh my goodness, so much to do. Um, and then I'm going to need to pop over to the hazardous ruins again. Now the boombox chest, I'm going to go boombox and lift. I'm going to rename it. Boombox and lift. Let's have a cap for that lift. So I put all my lift stuff in there as well. So one of my lift things is going to be, oh, hardwood planks, which I'm already making. Iron wooden plank. What is an iron wooden plank and how do I make it? Marble. Oh. Ah, this is going to need some some sorting, isn't it? Mm. Let's see if in the item qu query we've got those planks and what's used to make them. Steel plate, industrial cutter level 2. Why do I get the feeling? Talisman, pan back mask. Perfume, talisman, photo album, sunglasses. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Iron wood plank. The civil cutter level one. Does the civil cutter have a level two then? I can only assume that it's made on the industrial cutter. Ah, we've got steel plate that is made on the industrial cutter and I've suddenly got some board that I can't make. I'm certainly not seeing civil cutter level 2. So I think the industrial Cutter is maybe the level 2 version of the civil cutter. Industrial furnace level 3. What's all these levels about? Okay, so I think uh, maybe we'll just carry on working on um, making DD stops and boom boxes for now. Because I'm getting iron woods every so often. I've got a little bit of iron wood in my wood chest. We've got three of them so far. 
And I imagine that if I cut down the really super big trees with a um, upgraded uh, sort of steel axe or sorry, an iron axe. If I cut down the, tr the massive trees with an iron axe, then I will probably be able to get um, loads more ironwood. A jet tube. Used to control gas release can be used to craft weapons. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? A flamethrower. Oh yeah. Simple antidote, that'd be useful. A valve to turn on and off a pipe. I'm thinking irrigation system for that, but okay, what have we got that we can use? So we've got some fiber cloth. Can pick that up. Yeah. Which we can use for the roof here. We have the plates that we can use. Get it in my quick bar. There we are. I've got the plates I can use. So we're just really waiting on the hardwood then. I need to keep making bronze plates. All the fuel is depleted. Oh no. Do I have more bronze that I can use? Yes. Craft the maximum amount I can. Um. Oh, do I need bronze bars for this? I think I might do. Let's just double check. Bronze pipes. Can I make any bronze pipes? No, because I used all the bronze. Let's cancel it. And if I can. Hmm. That's run out of power as well. I oh, know it's not. I'll cancel it. Yeah. Take back all the bronze. And then I'm going to craft, like, four. And then I'll make bronze pipes out of the rest. I only need two. And the rest can be made into bronze plates if I need any more bronze plates. Uh, how's the hardwood planks going? We have one so far. Oh, good. Going well, then. Really super well. Well, with the lift, I was at least given the um, schematics for it. So I'm going to go out on a bit of a limb here. I'm going to take my data disks and I'm going to... I'm going to use some of them. I've got a lot of them now. I've got 17. I think I could afford to maybe use 5 or even 10. And we do need to start unlocking all the super groovy stuff, don't we? And it might be a while. I'm going to have to unlock a few things, I think, before I can unlock that uh, grinder I need for the Bassanio lift. So I'm mm, going to have to really start grinding these data disks up. going to mean a lot of mining, guys. I apologize for that because I ramble when I mine. I have to think of lots of interesting talk. Higgins, get out of here. I hate you. Um, lots of things for me to ramble about. If I find anything valuable from the old world, donate it, and you have no idea how much a discovery can change the world. Don't listen to the church. We just want progress. Science versus the church. But Petra is who we probably really want to speak to. It's October, apparently. Fresh fruit for some juice. Yum, yum, yum. I like juice. Okay. Did you discover something new? Uh, we'll do five. We'll have something by tomorrow. So I'm hoping that might be the cook pot. Once I get the, pot, the cook pot, I'll go and do the quest for um, Dawa up in the tree farm. The fish stew that he wants. I have to catch the fish myself. Then I'm not too bad at the fishing anymore. No, so I'm being very silly. I'm running all the way down here and I don't need to because there are DD stops now. 
And while I'm down here, should I pop in the ruins and see if I can get that last um, silicone chip? I'll just pop in level one again. Take hours out of my day though. I don't mind too much. I've got an inventory absolutely chock full of stuff as well, so I'm not gonna be able to collect too much, but because most of the junk in my inventory has come from the hazardous ruins, it might be stuff that stacks. Just gonna run past these guys. Never know, might get a level. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna be quite interested in the hidden, hidden level. We never quite managed the last time I was playing to get through level two. Um, do you know what? Why don't we just go in at level two? I might get a bit more stuff in level two. Concentrating. Stupid ply rims. Certainly get lots of money coming in here. And a senti dog. I feel bad killing dogs, especially little cute robot dogs. They like to show up, don't they? When I, I just think I get some fat loot and these guys all show up. It's definitely a bit more difficult in here. Everything's level 16. I imagine the boss will probably be like level 18 or something. Some more tempering liquid, which is always useful. There's a big old chest up there, which would be darn handy, especially if it happens to contain what I want. And we've got seven layers this time. Okay, so the seven different rooms we have to go in. Probably won't do the whole lot. That is what I needed. We carry on and do a little bit more just to see what the levels are like. Won't hurt, will it? While I'm waiting around anyway. Killing all the fishies. And killing all the player imps. Mass Fiend's are level 17 now as well, so... I'm getting loads of stuff though, I'm getting loads of money. Look at my money. Like 1,300 now. Now this one is always interesting because... You always want to try and get the chest, but it's gonna sting. I'm already down to half health as well, so... Just did it. Okay, so what I want to do is wait until the jets are finished, jump over and stand next to the chest. And hopefully they shouldn't catch me. Open the chest. Another silicon chip. Wait for it to finish. Run and jump. That wasn't too bad. Didn't miss anything there, I don't think. That oh, was all right, that one. There is a long, there's a double sized version of that as well. But yeah, we did quite a few layers so far. I'm quite impressed. Especially if it gives my, all my health back for the boss, that's always useful. We got another data disc. Oh, good, good, good. I like data discs, they are useful and handy. Plow our way through the masked fiends. 
kind of play by the the best defense's offense. That's why I've given my character defensive skills, is because I play by just whacking everything, so... I kind of need the actual character itself to be defensive to make up for my lack of playstyle. Level 16! Yay! Give me extra stamina, give me a, give me all my health back as well. It's always handy. So much fat loot in this dungeon. Die, Senti Dog, die. Fiend is down. Loads of chests I can get in here. There's like three of them. So good. It's got oh special items, small engine. So that's another DD. Ah no, I'm in the poison. Another DD car that I can get. Another silicone chip. I think we'll be all right for them now. Quite some time. Stood in the poison again. Another copper coil. It'd be really good for the boom box now. And one last player in enemy. The goals are coming thick and fast, and there's things are. One of those engines was an industrial one. Two smalls and an industrial. Industrial, I think, are going to be needed for some of these bigger things that I'm going to be making. Yeah, just see how far I can I can push it. We're on level five of seven now. More mass feeds and senti dogs. I'm really thirsty, but I can't take a drink because I have to fight. I have to keep fighting. Mind you, I'm probably not as thirsty as Sheilab is. Sheilab's probably really thirsty because she's like having to do loads of work. Another small engine. I've got like three so far. That's amazing. If nothing else, they sell for fortune. But if I make them into DD cars, they sell for even more of a fortune. If I can make like five DD cars, I can sell them for enough to expand my land. And then I'll be rolling in money. Don't have much uh, in the way of health left though, do we? We've got one more room to do after this and then that's the boss room. I might pull out before then, I'll see. But we're definitely getting loads of really high level stuff and we're getting so much money. Crazy. So happy, I'll take a drink now. Of water. You're like, Sheila, that's why you're so happy you're drinking. But no, I'm drinking water. Well. Plyrop is trying to drag me into the poison. Just like these dancing fish are gonna do. Okay. Oh my goodness, I ran out of stamina. I think I have to leave. Wow. I was not expecting that. I don't think I came in with a full stamina load though. So the fact that I managed to get all that stuff though, so good. So we'll just catch an old uh, DD car home. I uh, will hopefully be getting that DD stop done very, very shortly. Just in time for me to finish the ruins and not need to go in there again. 
would not surprise me. But I'll get another DD stop done almost straight away after that. And I'll put it up on Bassanio Falls. Once I've actually... I wonder what the hidden level is. I know, yeah, once I've actually um, gotten up there and done the steel carbon bars and the iron wood planks. It's going to take a lot of research to do that. But anyway, here we are. DD stop. Back to my house. I had to run almost half the way, so it actually is going to be really, really useful. Really, really, really useful. To have a DD stop there. And we're nearly there with it. Um, we have now the bronze pipes. Great. 14 springs. I remember, I remember when I was struggling for two. I was like, I need two springs. I'll have to mine very just for those. How far we have come. So there's also going to be some hardwood planks here for us. So that should be a DD stop all ready. But next time we go to the ruins. So we'll take that in our inventory. And then have a little wee snooze. Because we have no stamina left at all. Maybe some extra stamina items in my house would have been useful there. Oh look! Oh look, there's a, a mail for me. We'll mail you the results within two days. Oh, that might be next episode! Cool! Fantastic. They're going to take longer every single time. Or it's like different things have different lengths of time. I mean, that's five data disks worth. But the whole point is that we've got all of these things in the assembly catalogue that we don't know what they are. And I would like to know what all of them are. So the lift controls is one that we got just from a quest. There's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven different things that we do not know what they are at all. Do you know what I'm thinking might be a really good thing to do? If I can. Let's try and get some like plant boxes going. See how they work and everything. Get a pot of Asteria. I think that just goes in the house. I'm sure there were planter pots in the work table. Our food, equipment, drugs, furniture. Okay, these are not sorted. The way they should be sorted at all. Dough, perfume, colourful hat, pound backs, desk lamps, jewellery boxes. Let's go to the work table. I might have a bit of a more organised approach, but I think there were planter boxes. I don't know what I'd be able to plant in them though. Water bucket. More planting box. Box full of soil can be used to plant crops made with cultivated soil from the work table. Work table level two. I want to know how to make cultivated soil then. This is where cultivated soil isn't in yet. It might be Animal bones and mucus. That could be cultivated soil. I'm making a planter box. I'm gonna try it, guys. Hardwood planks two, cultivated soil one. Right, I'm gonna see if this is cultivated soil. Animal bones and mucus. We definitely have animal bones and mucus. So let's try it. 
and see if that is actually cultivated soil. It doesn't say what it is, you see. So I'm going to go out on a limb and see if we can make it. At the end of the day, what do we lose? Animal bones and mucus. We can't we don't use that for anything else. So I have a random bag of randomness. It was this one, wasn't it? Planting box, cultivated soil from work table. Nope, don't have that. So what's this then? Is this seeds or something? No one knows. I've made it, but no one knows what it is. Okay, so I'm guessing that that is a system that's still kind of being worked on. I'll just stick that back in my misc chest. So, my uh, mechanical parts chest is going to be getting filled up quite a lot with random engines and parts and all sorts of random things that have got out of the ruins. Sulfate. I might actually put sulfate in my rocks and sands chest. I think that's probably the most appropriate place for it to be. And then there's a load of metal that I've picked up. I need to be in a miscellaneous chest somewhere. That's those. Probably mechanical parts for the spanners. I haven't had to use a spanner yet. Maybe you have to repair stuff. That might be a, a mechanic. Quite a cool mechanic, actually. Tempering stuff probably needs to go in there. Well, loads of data disks still. I'm waiting on the research centre at the moment for them. Teeth and wood and loads of those apple things. What do they do? Stamina. <laughs> I gotta just eat those. I have like seven of them. Oh, hang on, that's not food anymore. That's boombox and lift stuff. So we'll put them in there. Hopefully I'll get the cooking station soon. Okay, so how are we doing for this? Commission, fiber cloth times 10. Get that going again. And then the boom box. Let's have a look what else we need for it. There's a lot that we can make on the boom box. Boom box? The boom box now. And book, assembly catalogue, boom box. Eight bronze plates. I only need one more. Iron bars and rubber fruit. I have enough of those. I have copper bars and leather. And copper coils. They still haven't fixed this. They need two copper coils to make the leather horn, but I think you need four copper coils because you actually need copper coils for the leather horn as well as copper coils for the boom box itself. So that needs to be fixed. I'm sure they'll catch that in QR at some point. Right, so... I'm gonna make me a cassette. That I need iron, rubber fruit, okay. Iron. Rubber fruit. I'll make a cassette box. I might be able to make this today actually, which is pretty cool. So we can start on the irrigation stuff. Um, I only need to craft one. And then the next thing I'm going to want is one of those leather form things. I think I might need two of these. So copper coil, blue leather, copper bar. I've got the copper bars. So I need to grab my blue leather, which I think is in here. Of which I have got... Oh, I do this every time. I've got 16 and I need 18. Right. 
Do you know what then? I'm going to go to the collapsed wastelands and I'm going to put my DD stop down and I'm going to get myself two leather while I'm down there. That sounds like killing two birds with one stone and that would be really good because I might get two leather off those two birds. Yeah, I know. The puns are fantastic. I should be able to get them off slurpees within about two seconds. That's one. I did a critical hit for 200 damage then. I am a menace. By the time I've gotten this um, DD stop done, I will have my two blue leathers. Oh, yeah, I have already got my two blue leathers. So what I want to do is put this DD stop down and then just go straight home. Using the DD stop. Because I'm so lazy. I'm so utterly lazy. But when you start going in these ruins, the money starts meaning a lot less. So... This will cost 50 golds, and I don't even care. Because I'm just so rich. Okay. So now we have enough blue leather to make the leather horns. Sheilapa, stop being silly. I'm miscounting twice in a row. My copper coils. I did have copper coils. Did I put them away in here? Yes. Perfect. So, two leather horns. Beautiful. So, set. Leather horns. One copper coil, and I need two, so I might need to make another one. I've got enough stuff to make one more. Not a problem with an eyeglass. But that'll be useful for something. Not sure what, but something. And I know I should be making more bronze and, and, and stuff, but I don't care. I need one more bronze plate. I believe I need eight bronze plates for it. Is that right? Let's build it and then I'll just get a nice little neat list instead. So, copper coil times two. Need to make one more of those. Made that. Got one more bronze plate that's being made. Got the silicone chips and the two leather horns. We are done. We are absolutely done. Get the silicone chips. I'll start putting stuff on here actually. And put the copper coils on one at a time as well. I don't know why those have insisted on going in there. So I decided to swap places. So, the leather horns have gone on. Like I said, needs to go on there. Copper coils. Need the two of them apparently. Okay. How do I make a copper coil then? I can make it with three copper wire and two iron bars, so I just need my copper wires. I've got loads of them in here anyway. And that will mean I don't need to go back to the ruins or anything silly like that. Where I can get this thing made. Copper coils done. Two of those. On they go. Boom. I've got to wait an hour for that. Hmm. And that will be the end of that then. Sorry that you guys had to watch me do that twice. How are we doing for the uh, fibre cloth? Have 14, this will be 17. We're just pretty much waiting on that as well. Okay. Time to do some inventory management then. That always takes me lots of time. So let's get all these things out of here that are not meant to be in here and put away all the things that are. Like the copper.
copper, things like that. Let's pop over to the... Well, you know what? I'm going to put these copper pipes in there as well. Bronze bars I'm going to keep... The bronze plates I'm going to keep on me just because they're needed. So these are all my bits and bobs. Put the lens in there as well. Copper coils. Um, venom and bone should really just be in the misc chest. I don't know how long the misc chest is going to need... Am I subdividing again? Honestly. I mean, I could take Emily her bucket. That would be some a nice way to pass the time, wouldn't it? I'm sure she'll be around her farm somewhere. So that, 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 that. Fabric's in the fabric chest. I can't say chest for some reason today. I don't know what that's all about. Five hardwood planks in there. That wood in there getting there now I think got a few, a few more things for the miscellaneous chest oh my goodness it's so full um, teeth yeah we have teeth they'll stack those won't those need to go in the fabric chest but those won't fit in there at all okay I might have to put that in the mechanical parts chest. Uh, and um, I mean, I suppose it kind of looks sciencey, right? Ish. Don't know. Rubber fruit can go in there because it's like rubber, right? Yeah. Very tenuous at the moment, this uh, chest sorting system. And this will go in the food chest over here, which has not got too much in it at the moment. Ah, it's brilliant. Right. While I was sorting all that lot out, surprise, surprise, that got sorted. That was pretty much what I was waiting to do. I knew that if I did inventory management, that would sort everything out. So we have ourselves a boombox. So I'm going to be like the laziest she lab in the whole wide world and take the DD stop up to the tree farm. I need to go in the hazardous ruins just to get the goals back that I spend on the DD transport. Ah, this is great. Hey guys. Yeah, it worked last time, so it'll definitely work this time, right? I'm afraid of using relics. The church told us to use as little of them as possible. Bad things happen when they're used. You're afraid of everything. We have no other choice. Go ahead and try it. A man of honour. Okay, so let's get this boombox. Let's pop it down here. The boombox. Interesting how I said it was a boombox. And they showed a graphic of a loudspeaker. I definitely clicked the right thing, didn't I? Anyway, they're friendly now. Here's your commission. You earned it. It worked. Maybe I'll order you. I'll order a couple from you in the future. Fantastic. Okay, so now the pan back issue has been resolved. We need to move quickly to heal our trees. The pan backs took a lot of water and nutrients. We need a fast way of restoring them. We'll commission you for this job. Can you help us? Yes. Petra mentioned she knew something about an irrigation system before. Maybe you should chat with her. Always about Petra. So now I have a boombox. That I can apparently sell. I wonder how much a boombox sells for. I mean, he said he might order them in future, so I don't, like, don't know whether to wait for an order or just sell it outright. Let's have a look. 1,300. Also, plus something to my house. Max health plus 20. I'm putting that in my house. I could do with 20 extra health. I have a fan in my inventory. I don't know what that does. 
Uh, it's not my retreat, it's in one of the chests, but I want to see if I can put that down. That's plus 16 extra health as well, so it's like if I can get those down in my house, it'd be very useful. I'll try and put the boom box down first, just in case they don't all fit. So it's tea for turn, turn it around, put it next to my sofa. I'm trying to put it down next to my sofa, but it won't go down on the floor. How about the fan? Turn it around. Oh, that will go. Cool. Well, boombox, why won't you place? It's not telling me that it's already full or anything like that. Okay, let's have a look at it again. So it's 541 health that I've got at the moment. Is it just if I carry it with me? I'm going to put it away and I'll see if it gives me less health then. So it's 541 health at the moment that I've got. So if I put the boom box away. Does that affect it? No. So I'm not entirely sure what's going on with the boom box, whether that needs to be placed outside rather than in the house. Um, it might be that there are certain things I can place outside and they'll be useful. Um, try that. Try popping it down maybe here, turn it around, pop it down. No, apparently I'm attacking things with it. So the boom box doesn't place. Which is really weird. But it can stay in my chest for now and I, I may sell it, I may not. We could give Emily back her bucket. Oh, I was getting late though. Super duper late. We need, need to speak to Petra as well. So I think it's probably going to be time for me to head to bed. And wrap up the recording for today. And then tomorrow we'll go speak to Petra and we'll start on the irrigation system. So we are now completely back to where we were last time. Because this is the, the quest we were on with the tree farm. We were getting the irrigation system sorted. So I am super happy with that. So there we are. So today we've we put a new fan in our house and got some extra health from it. We've um, finished the boombox quest. We've picked up the irrigation quest. We still don't have all the stuff we need. And oh, this next episode is going to be awesome because this next episode we're going to get a new thing from the research center. And I don't know what it'll be. It could be an interesting surprise. So anyway, stay tuned next time to find out what that little surprise is. And uh, I hope you will be back for the next one. But in the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.